When Parliament passed the NSSF amendment bill into law and the president ascended to it in January 2022, Ugandans like Robert Sebunya, a resident of Chiwatuli, already had plans. Sebunya has a house he had started constructing a while ago in Namayumba, Wachiso district, but had halted building due to financial constraints. His hope was in section 20A of the amendment, which would allow him to access 20% of his savings. I was among the very people who was very, very happy, and I was asking myself, when is it beginning or when is it starting? However, since the president assented to the act, there has been no regulations to manage the disbursement of the funds. All that has changed now that the Minister for Gender and Labour, Betty Amongi, has confirmed that the regulations are ready. We will finalise everything, so it will become law today, and therefore with effect from Monday 7th, March 2022, eligible members, as described uh, in the regulation and articulated in my statement, will now be free to apply for midterm access. Among explained the requirements for one to apply for this money, which include possession of a national ID and an NSSF number. The people living with disabilities can access their savings if they are at least 40 years of age. If you are an, a refugee, you will need your uh, Islam seeker or refugee registration documents. This is always issued by Office of the Prime Minister and you will need your national social security number. Sebunya is delighted by the news. Because I've been eagerly waiting for that money, I'm now very, very happy. However, he still has questions for the minister. But we don't know whether they have uh, recruited the uh, mobile money agents or we are going to receive the money from the districts or from our area. Once you have applied and you have assessed and you meet all the requirements, you will then choose which payment methods or option you will want you will be able to be paid either through the bank or through mobile money. An estimate of 50 billion shillings will be paid per week for the first five months. According to Amongi, when everything has been assessed, the applicant will be in position to receive their money within 14 to 21 days. Solomon Kawesa, NTV.